Hi guys, PD here, welcome to the channel, welcome to another new video. Today we're playing Yopper Saves the Universe, this is a brand new game, I have never played it before in my life. I'm playing with the um, Xbox One controller. Oh, hello puppies. I'm playing on the Oculus Rift S and this looks amazing, so sharp, so clear. Oh, there they are. Oh, I'll be taking these. Oh, <laughs> you stupid piece of shit. <laughs> oh, crazy. Oh, crazy. <laughs> <laughs> you stupid piece of shit. <laughs> we now okay, we're in a the chair turns. We're in a chair? You rotate your chair, Samantha. All I ever asked of you is that you rotate your chair. I don't like rotating my chair. If you now if you're fans of Rick and Morty, chair, God damn it. it's the Did same guys who's made this game. Rotate your chair, Samantha. I know how to rotate Reginald. I'm not okay, so we I know rotating the chair. The right thumbstick to the right or left to rotate my chair. I still refuse. Well, you never mess with objects by looking at Just them. Just forget it, Samantha. The big staring contest is tonight. We need to practice if we expect to win. Starting right now. Okay, I found the answer phone. Message. Message two. Your lawyer here. Not looking good, I'm afraid. Because the dogs were yours and because they seem to be powering this monster, you may be liable. Call me. End of message. Message three. Hey, asswipe! Your red is due! This isn't a charity! End of message. Message four. Hey, it's mom. I never did like those dogs of yours. I'm not surprised to be honest. I mean, now they're powering that big old beast monster. Sweetie, it's a big mess. Anyways, call me back. End of message. Okay, I'm using the um, shoulder pad hey, to Come out here. Get out here. interact with all these open items up. on the floor. Come on, open up. Okay, we'll open the door. Here comes Joppa. Oh, yeah, this is definitely the right place. You're the one. Okay, listen to me. We don't have time to get into it right now, but you're coming with me. We interrupt this program for an important breaking news. A giant big monster. You heard that right. A mother giant big monster has destroyed the science center damn near half the city stolen science equipment microscopes beakers i'm talking about flames things are really crazy right now shit's all f***ed up and this goddamn big monster has dogs that are plugged into its eyes and they are powering him up above any power level i've ever seen and he's scared people my grandmother's afraid all right back to your regular schedule program. man you really you, your dogs you have no idea how things are because of your two stupid dogs Oh. This is a power baby. Oh, hello. You're going to be seeing a lot of these throughout the whole game. I mean, I really love them. I got them in my eyeballs, you know? In my eye holes, I mean. So just here, look at this one that I just pulled out of my eye, and, and it'll come to you. Okay. Just look at it, and it'll come to you. We have the power baby. All right, listen, you're going to control me, man, because I'm tired, okay? I, you know how long it took me to find you? I'm exhausted. Hello. So you're in control. I, I'm like a remote control character now, all right? Okay. Use the left analog stick to control me. Okay, that's really cool. So I am controlling... The blue light that's shooting out of the ground. That's called the warp node. Get me over to the warp node. All right, let's get out of here. You can see the joypad moving when I move, look. Good God, you really got to think for those dogs, huh? All right, listen. Press the interact button to warp over. Oh, there we go. All right, and that's how we do it. Let's go. Okay, this world looks amazing. Uh, you want to soak this place in before we leave, huh? I, I get it. Yep. 
Let's check out this place. You know that monster that stole your dogs? His name is Glorcon. He's got your dogs plugged into his eyes like power babies. It, ma it made him unstoppable. Okay, guys, on a more serious note, this is really clever what the developers have done. So, this this is your digs, huh? This is your hood? What's this is like Trover that? Saves the what Universe. Do you own? And they've used, like, a Mandela effect. Looked all over the place. Thank God, I'm gonna dump your ass off at my boss. I'm gonna get my space money. Then I'm gonna go to this place in my home world where I get all crazy messed up called Empty Peepers. And the developers have added a new character called Yopper. Or Jopper. I'm sorry for being spacist. Alright, come on. There's a light on your controller. It's the... Alright, you got it. Let's keep going. Okay. Now this character is only available for about a week. It's a really clever idea what the developers have done here. They've got people talking about the game. Now this video is giving me a good opportunity to talk about the uh, Mandela effect. Jeez, what's with all the purple? Do you guys have strict homeowners association guidelines? Or, or are you a bunch of f***ing idiots? Haha, <laughs> just kidding, I'm... Yellow! I like yellow! Obviously. But seriously, come on, we gotta go. For those of you who don't know what the Mandela effect is, as well. it doesn't make any sense. It's basically when things that you remember in the past have changed. So if you search things that you remember in the past, right, look, it's nice and they have changed. The I'll give you a few examples throughout this gameplay. Huh? <laughs> whoa! 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 Holy whoa. Shit. <laughs> whoa! Whoa! Oh well, look who it is. I'm locking you here and making a citizen's arrest. Do you not think I don't know who you are, huh? Shake your head, yes or no. Answer me. No? Nope. Well, you're wrong. I do know who you are. You're the Cheropian with the dogs. Those dogs are in the eyes of that big monster, and it is f everything up now because your dogs gave him some kind of superpowers. So we have you to blame for this bullshit that we're going through right now. Do you feel sorry for what you've done? Answer me, yes or no. Do you feel any remorse? No. Nope. You're a heartless monster. It's bad enough you have the two dogs. Now you're hanging out with a pillow walk person. It's unchair like, you know. It's against the chair members to walk. Man, I don't have time for this bullshit. I got a sword. You threaten me, boy? I ain't for you. Come on. Okay. I'm trying to know <laughs> you, old man. <laughs> You asked for this. Uncle, uncle, please You're gonna stop. feel this tomorrow. Ah, just stop hitting me. Okay, we'll stop I now. I on your warp notes. Don't hurt me no more with the knife. <laughs> bitch. Ha <laughs> ha, you f***ing cowards. That's right, bitch. Run away from me, you criminal wow. coward. Okay, anything around here? Headed. Big tough guy hitting like an old man. Anywhere. You f***ing coward. Oh, oh boy, look at this <laughs> you area. Coward. I don't see any, you any run. warp That's notes right. over you here. You run away from me. Now I'm going to try a few experiments with you guys watching, just to see if you've had um, an experience with the Mandela effect. And I'm guessing that this is what this um, character is based on. So this is like Trover never existed. I'm going to give you some famous quotes from some classic films. And I want you guys to fill in the blanks. And we'll see if uh, the Mandela effect has happened to you guys. Shit, this is the science building we saw on the news. Look at all the stuff I got. Yeah, yeah, I got stuff too. Hey, what is all this stuff for? I don't know, but it's ours now. Hey, look, there's somebody we can beat up. Oh yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna rumble with that person. Hey, come here. Okay, lightsaber. Uh, I guess you better rumble. Before I start, I have to say this looks amazing on the Rift S. Okay. Right, come on, let's go to the telepod. It's back the other way. This way. Okay, so one of those quotes I want you to repeat after me. It's um, based on the Walt Disney film Snow White, and in the film, there's a famous line. Something, something on the wall. And I want you guys now watching. If you're watching live, put in chat those missing words. 
Finally, we're at the telepod. Hey, turn around. I'm behind you. Turn around. This is the telepod. So telepods are, are, are how we get around, okay? That's how we travel in the cosmos. They teleport us to where we'd like to go. So we're gonna use it to go to my boss's office so I can drop your ass off, your stupid ass off, and get my space money and get the hell out of here, you know what I mean? And go live my life. Go ahead and hit the button to uh, teleport us to my boss's office. Okay. when I woke up and realized she was dead. Oh, Yo, okay, boss, I'm sorry it took me so so long, but here's the chair orpian uh, in mint condition, so I'll take my space money and be on my way. Thank you very much. Actually, Yo, some things have changed since we've last talked. I'm going to need you to stay partners with the chair orpian. Your job's not over Come yet. On. You said all I had to do was find the stupid chair orpian and bring them to you, and then, and then I'd get my space money. Yo, Yo, shut the f*** up. I have the abstainers on the hollow dish phone. We are the abstainers. Holy shit, that's what the abstainers look like? They look just like the, the guy who's got the dots in his eyes causing all this trouble. Shut the f*** up. Joe Paul. No one needs to hear your commentary about everything. The abstainers would like to talk with the chair Orpian. It is true that we look like Gorkon. He was one of us. We were four, but he has broken free. Chair Orpian, is it true you were the owner of the dogs that power Glorcon? Yeah, it's definitely the right Chair Orpian. You should have seen, seen their apartment. We're not talking to you, shitbag. We're talking to the Chair Orpian. Are you the one that had the dog? Oh. So what Joe Paul is saying is true. You are the owner of the dog. I told you guys. We need to meet this Chair Orpian face to face. You must come to our home world, our inner sanctum. Wow, whoa, you're in the inner sanctum void, wow. Nobody's ever been to the Abstainer's Inner Sanctum. Oh, mama. This is going to be, that's going to be quite a, a little deluxe travel package. How does somebody even get to the Abstainer's Inner Sanctum? You must find the Crystal of Ithacles. It is located in a place called Shleamy World. Oh, oh, I know where Shleamy World is. All right, okay. All right, Joe Paul. Now, I'm sure you can see better as to why you, I needed you to stick around. We need you to protect this Chair Orpian. You and the Chair Orpian are a team. You're partners now. You're together. You're you're gonna need to go get that fucking crystal in from Shlimi World so that you can meet the abstainers face to face. Once you retrieve the crystal of Ithacles, you can plug it into the telepod. It will give you access to our inner sanctum. We must meet this Chair Orpian in person. It's of the utmost importance. Okay, all right, we got it. Jesus, Chair Orpian, uh, go ahead and hit the button on the telepod there uh, to teleport to Shlimi World. Yo, know, Jesus Christ, man. This is bullshit. No, Paul. I don't want to hear any bullshit from you. Yeah, you. all right, okay. You should have let me know that this was a possibility. I don't like surprises. No, there are higher things at stake here than, than that right now. So quit being a little baby and do as I ask. I'm your boss. I'm the one who pays your bills. Man, we had a deal and you're changing it Chirpian, up. Scorpion, hit the button on the telepod. I don't want to hear Joe Paul anymore. Okay, we're going to hang up now. Good, good luck. You know, we had a deal, man. You know, you... I, Jesus okay, the NPCs Jesus are calling him I Yopo. An asshole. Man, I didn't I didn't sign up for this shit, you know? And now the abstainers are involved. F man, the, the the abstainers, man. Imagine every time you've jerked off, they they've seen it. Every time you, you they watch they know they literally can describe to the minors detail every time you've taken a shit. They know every single moment. They know everything. They've seen everything. I don't like them. I don't I, I don't I, I they make me uncomfortable. The abstainers. Okay, if you said mirror, mirror on the wall, you are wrong. Now you can search Google, you can search, search the internet. And that quote is now magic mirror on the wall. In fact, a friend of mine did not believe me. Hey, hey, look at me. Hey, I'm Mr. Pop-Up and I need your help. All right, who, who is this guy? I told you I'm Mr. Pop-Up. I called a number. I, I don't know who I called. They're just supposed to come and help me. All right, well, it's not us. Now, no, leave. No, f*** off. There's a man named Michael, and he, and he built a house on the bluff, and and that's not zoned for residential usage. It's zoned. Oh, ow. I'm floating up here now. You can't hit me up here. It's zoned for public use, and I'm very upset about it. We don't know what the f*** you're talking about, dude. It's got nothing to do with us. We got our own shit to deal with, all right? You gotta help me out. I can't do anything. It's this guy, Michael. He's a total asshole. He's 
He's treated me like shit my whole life. Good, now go away. No, it's bad. He thinks he's hot shit and can do whatever he wants. It's not fair. Sitting up, <laughs> asshole. Sitting up there in his, in his red house. I would have built my house up there, but I didn't because I know how to follow the rules. You're disgusting. You're naked. Go away. I know you guys will help. <laughs> oh, I, I mean, hold on. I'm choking on something here. I'll be right back. Jesus, I hope whatever he's choking on kills him. All right, you got it. Let's keep going. Okay, a friend of mine did not believe this, and he um, got his old... Um, Snow White VHS out, an old cassette of the film, and he was shocked to hear that the uh, word has changed to magic mirror on the wall and not mirror mirror on the wall. Now, I always remember as a child, it was mirror mirror on the wall. Shit, there's a bunch of little gremlins over there, they just killed me. Y you see the hearts on, on, on your controller? When those go down to zero, I die. And if you find any red power babies, those things will give me health. The more important thing is we focus on finding the crystal of Ithacles. Oh, looking for the crystal of Ithacles, huh? Well, I have the crystal of Ithacles right here. I'm the one who has the crystal. Big surprise, big reveal. Holy shit, how did you get that? The abstainers gave it to me like 50 years ago to hold on to. You guys want it? You guys need this? Well, all the people that have it, yes. We need it, please. Okay, well now you have to do what I say. Get that guy Michael off the bluff. Here, I'll, I'll help you out. You're gonna need a chair upgrade because you can't even see over this log. So I'm gonna give you a chair upgrade. Here it comes, your chair upgrade. <laughs> hey, what the hell, you lunatic? You just spit all over the chair. No, 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 no. I, I just gave him a chair upgrade. Upgrade. It's it's how we do things around here. I, we spit, pop up with me. It's your new magical chair upgrade. Pop up, yeah, pop up with me. Come on, you can pop up. Just pop up. Okay, good. Do you see the house? Use your blinky blinksters and look at it. It's way back there. You have to see it. Don't you see it? There are a few more I can go into. One is based on the famous film with Tom Hanks in it. And that is Forrest Gump. Okay, most of you will remember the film as being Life is like a box of chocolates. Well, that's all changed now. It's, it no longer says Life is like a box of chocolates. It now says Life was like a box of chocolates. Because that sentence does not make sense anymore. Now again, you can check the internet, you can check Google, you can find any old CDs, DVDs, any old films, and that line has now been changed in the film. Oh crap. Well, this is as far as we go. Got ourselves a real... Oh shit, look, look above the gate. One, one of these things got a thumbs up on it. Before they were all three... Oh yeah, I, I see, I see what you're looking at up there. Three buttons. Ooh, that's a lot harder than one button. Jeez, that's three buttons. I don't know. That's rough. That's. Whoa, holy shit. We got two green thumbs up. Oh, easy, easy. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. It's just a gate. You gotta solve a puzzle or, or do something else. You can't ru rush through. Whoa, holy sh. Whoa, whoa, holy shit, dude. I mean, I can see that puzzle from down here. That That's insane. That's an insane puzzle. Now, I remember many, many years ago, I watched the film. And it features a bad guy, he's called Jaws, he's got metal teeth. Jesus, I don't know. And there's a famous Did scene in the film online? where I mean, maybe he meets his girlfriend for the online. first time. The whole reason he the fell in love with this, with this girl with was because buttons. she had braces. That's not fun. Is that this working? Isn't fun? This isn't a good game. Just a bunch of buttons, it's lazy. <laughs> this dude, come down. C come back down. C <laughs> screw this shit. Let's just knock this shit down, but we'll strong arm it. We'll brute force it. Yeah, screw that gate! It was logical that they fell in love and they became boyfriend, girlfriend. But now if you go back and watch the uh, the videos... Whoa, you just got another green power, baby! Dude, you are her braces have dead. gone. Which I found really, really strange because again, it makes no sense to the to the film. Hey, holy shit, there's, a, there's one! A green power, baby! The green ones are super important to me! 
Scorpion, just look at the green. Hey, excuse me. How's it going? My name's Tony. I'm Upgrade Tony. I got a real issue over here. If you and again, that's another mind, example just, uh, of Mandela effect. Me. I got a real issue right now. Hey, yeah, what's the problem? I got these little ankle biters over here. They're trying to kill me. It's giving me anxiety. Okay, well, what do you want us to do? I want you to kill them. If you kill them, I'll give you this awesome power baby upgrade. Okay, remember not to kill these ones over here. These are his, they're his pets. Jump. It's so much fun. It's the funnest So we need to kill ever. these Man, ones. I, I've always wanted a double jump glide power baby upgrade. Yeah, I bet you do. Hey, you guys did it. You done did it. Come back. Come up to my cool stand. I got an upgrade for you. Oh, thank you guys so much. You guys. I do have a first impressions video on this game awesome when it was called Trover Saves the Universe. Gonna give you double jump and glide. Oh, man, thanks. In that oh, video, I actually killed his pets, which was quite funny. These were his pets over here a lot. Come on, let's grab that upgrade, man. I'm stoked. Okay, let's grab this. Okay, check this out. Watch this. This is crazy. Eat each other. You see the shit? He's eating the other ones. F insane. That's what they do when you put them close together. Isn't that crazy? And all the powers are now in, in, in combined into this one power baby. And here we go. We're ready to double okay, jump. Okay, we've got baby. double jump now. Double jump now. If you hold the jump button down after I'm in the air, I'll glide around. All right, this is really a win-win here. Thanks again for the favor. You really uh, took care of those little gremlins, ankle biters, and also I gave you an upgrade. So we, we really uh, complement each other. Supply and demand. One favor for another. Oh, you killed my friend. Get him. Now, I'm a big believer in the um, simulated okay, universe back. hypothesis. And the Mandela effect fits perfectly with this theory. Too easy, man. Okay. Kill these guys. There are a lot more examples of the Mandela effect. There is a reddit dedicated to the concept. Hey, what the so this guy. I'm having a blast with this on the Rift S. This is the first time I've seen the game on the Rift S and it looks amazing. I kind of almost feel bad for these guys. Well, these guys jump on here the guys with the uh, guns are quite deadly really grab the grab the power baby if you've never played this game this character is only available for one week A lot of work has gone into this um, game just to add this new character. You do get an achievement if you complete the game with him before the week's over. Okay, kill this guy up here. And we need to jump on here. Try and kill these guys. Kill the bad guy, kill the boss. 
Can I knock him off? That's really funny, I knocked him off. Okay. Head towards the um, save point. Man, Gorkon's not f***ing around sending all those clones after us like that. Alright, well, well, we're basically at Michael's house. Let's go. Hey, Michael, come out! Okay, this is hey, the obnoxious no, guy. What? Can I kill him? What do you want, man? This is a private event. I don't give a shit. We're here to push your house over the cliff. Oh, 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 you're pushing this house over. This one right here. Yeah, give me one sec. What the f are you doing? What here is comes that? the poo in the face. Is that shit? Oh, sorry yeah. about that. I guess I forgot what direction my toilet was in. Oh, get the f*** out of here. Get the hell off my property. This is a private event. Look, asshole, we need the crystal of Ithacles. Mr. Pop-Up said... Mr. Pop-Up? Crystal of Ithacles? Shit, that guy's just pissed because I ate his family. Wait, seriously? That's right. But what Pop-Up needs to realize is that we're all just meat. Their energy is still around. I just ate their meat, okay? Energy never dies. The flesh can be consumed, but the spiritual energy is still in the cosmos, you f***ing assholes. Tell you what, I'll give you my crystal of Ithacles right here. If you knock that boulder over the cliff on a Mr. Pop-Up's house and kill him. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm going to go back inside where I have a... No, I did that last time. I knocked the boulder onto the house. The I'm using an this time, I'm going to push his house off. To inject into their bodies and induce early birth so that I can consume the flesh of their fetuses. Okay, is that <laughs> Jesus another one of these types yes Scorpion, turn me facing you so we could talk for a second. Yep. Okay, hey, listen, I wasn't even supposed to be here. What do you want to do? Do you want to kill mr. Pop-up? We, 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 we got to kill somebody we got to pick one because I want to get the stupid shard of it the and get out of here Okay, so what do you what are you what are you thinking do you you want to kill mr. Pop? You know what? I'm with you. I agree. That little pop-up guy was super annoying. No. Flying around in our face. So, no, okay, not pop-up. Just to be super sure, we're going to no. kill Mr. Pop-up. No. Right? No. Other guy. No. Come on, partner, like we did with the old man. Yep. No. So, you want to kill Michael then? Okay, yep. yeah. I mean, the guy, this guy, Michael, is talking about injecting fluids into pregnant women and... Inducing pregnancy and eating the, their babies. I mean, I, I see yep. where you're coming from. Okay, so kill you Michael. Kill Michael then. Yep. Yeah, kill Michael. And, and plus the fact that he reached into his ass and, and got a ball of shit and threw it in your face. Exactly. I mean, for God's sakes. Uh, final answer. We kill Michael. Yes or no? Yes. Okay, Disgusting let's human. Okay. Then knocking a house filled with innocent pregnant women. No. Nope. Right off a cliff. Here we go. Let's go. Here it goes! What the hell? Knocked it off! You're gonna kill a bunch of pregnant ladies and ruin my dinner! Alright! Haha! <laughs> hey, you, hey! Oh my god, you guys did it! You killed Michael! Oh yes. my god! You, you guys actually did it! I thought you guys would have just picked one of those crystals up off the ground! It seems like the most logical way to way to go about things. What, what are you talking about? You did it. I didn't know. I didn't think you would have had what it takes. I'm not gonna lie. I'm really sad that Michael's gone, but I've got bigger issues ahead of me. I need to find out where all my pregnant wives are. Here's your crystal of Ithacles, you dum dum. These are all over the place. I pulled this one out of my ass. My little schmubbler got all. Oh uh, Jesus Christ! He had that crystal up his ass. I don't want that in my. I don't want that in my teleport. All right, get the f out of here. Go to that special teleportation warp node. That'll warp you back to the telepod you came in. Get the f out of my world, you limp leg chair f and you stupid. Ow. I'm Mr. Pop Up, and I'm Go away. Up thinking about you guys. Okay, he's gone. I gotta okay. tell you, you know, you surprised me back there, Chair Orpian. I didn't think you had what it takes to kill somebody. You know, I thought you were just a baby that needed their hand held. Well, wow, we teleported. We're here. Holy shit. What, th there's crystals everywhere. How do we miss all these? Or did we not notice these before? They're all over the place. And there's a crystal. Okay, guys, I'll leave it there. Hope you enjoyed the video. This has been uh, really cool. That's all you Thank you for watching. Really Hope you enjoyed the video. Please leave a like and subscribe. Be sure to hit my little bell. Bye. It looks like Jumbo's already installed it and upgraded the telepod. Now you Bye, can Apple. teleport to the abstainer's home.